Hello, this is Danielle Daughtry of Sanford, also known as Nurse Danielle. My name is Elijah Sanford. And I'm here to let, let you all know this, my personal story time of the runaway test taker. Somebody ran away when I took my RN state board. So I'm just going to give my son the notes so he can kind of trigger my memories. So I, and then I'm gonna, I can be a little bit more go into detail. 1980s. All right, so it was in the 1980s during Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. What other music? Public Enemy, everything else? Yeah, all that good stuff. Mm -hmm. The test was paper. So yes, at that time we had a paper test, no computers, and it was two days. And pretty much it was two days time. Verifying identification. So before I went in there, we there was a long, like a long hall, and it was tables there, and it was by last name. They had to verify the identity, so you had the standard social security cards, birth certificates, driver's licenses, and they would verify your identity. Huge room. So it was a huge room. It was in Los Angeles. It was near the Coliseum, and it was like a huge auditorium. I just remember it being just huge with hundreds of people in there. Proctors walking around. So you had all these people walking up and down, even before we were taking the test, just walking, watching us put our, like I had a purse, put it up under the chair. They're looking to see what's in your purse, everything. I think you were allowed like a number two pencil and everything else had to go under there and it had to be Nothing could be visible. Several test versions. So at that time, because it was a paper test, it was not computer, there, there were multiple versions of the test. So you might be sitting with someone next to you, but nobody had the same test. So the tests were passed out a certain way and they were collected a certain way. And we all had numbers, we had assigned seats, and that's pretty much how it was time warnings. So throughout the entire test, I can't even remember how long it was, but I just remember them counting down saying one hour left, you know, 30 minutes left, 10 minutes left, and then they would call time. And you would have to sit there with your hands in your um, lap. That was pretty much it. As all this is happening, someone who sat in front of you broke out ran with one of the tests. Right, so pit, picture this. All the tests are passed out. There's proctors. They have given us instructions and they're just about to tell us to open up our tests to start. This person, I can't remember if it was a man or woman, picked up the test, start breaking and running, pushed through the door. It was a beautiful day in LA at the Coliseum and you could just see the sun shining out there as this person took off running and a car pulled on the side and they jumped in that car. Everybody chased behind them and they were gone. Um, there was a person behind you racing after they put, uh, they brought out the next test. Yes, but before I even get to the erasing person, I just need to sit with this person took off with the test. Okay? So they told us to keep our hands on the desk. They they this person was running after him. That person was gone. They collect all the tests. They told us not to move. They made us leave the room. They're still running around trying to get this person that's already gone up the street and is probably selling the answers or something. They had to get another version of the test, bring us back in and restart the time again. All right, so I've already talked about this person taking off running. So they've escorted us all out of the room, put us all out, and they have to have us again come and get back in this long line, re-verify our identities, and come back in. So after I'm taking the test and they've called the time for us to start, there's this person behind uh, me that is just erasing and erasing and erasing and this other person is mumbling and they have to shush them. 
And then finally it was time. And so by the end of that day, I was done. You know, um, I went out shopping and then I came back the next day and did the same thing. But imagine that being your experience with the test. Now I did pass the test, but that was my event with my NCLEX test. So um, I hope that everybody has a great experience when they take the N NCLEX. I hope it isn't like mine. Uh, again, my name is Danielle Dawtreve Sanford. You could reach me on Twitter. I'm on Facebook under the name Nurse Danielle. And you could also follow me on LinkedIn and on YouTube under Danielle Dawtreve Sanford. Take care.